The GBI is investigating another officer-involved shooting, this time in the city of East Point, involving three officers. This happened on Luther Drive after a series of responses from police to the same location involving the same man. The final time ended up with shots being fired, the officer and the individual both firing shots. Fox 5's George Franco joins us live tonight from the East Point Police Department with the story. George? Well, Doug, the GBI tells us that the three East Point police officers involved in this shooting were not injured. The suspect was. The GBI took over this case after investigators say East Point police responded several times to Luther Drive involving the same man who appeared to be, quote, inebriated. The first response came in the early morning hours to a call of shots fired. Randy Ivey tells me he isn't particularly shocked by an officer-involved shooting, but is shocked it happened on Luther Drive, where he has lived more than three decades. It's shocking in a way, but it happened all the time. That's, it's just bad. But does it happen in your neighborhood? This is the first time. See, that's what I'm saying. When it hit home, that's different. This woman who didn't want her face shown didn't know if the gunfire she heard was the same gunfire, which according to the GBI, involved three East Point police officers and 38-year-old Devin Harris. The first time I heard gunfire was 5 o'clock, around 5 o'clock. Uh, prior to that, I don't know, but I understand from neighbors there was some gunshot. The GBI tells Fox 5 News when East Point police responded to the area the last time, the officers encountered Harris with a gun. The GBI says at some point, Harris and the three officers fired their weapons. Is he okay? He's in the hospital recovery. Okay, okay, okay. Harris was taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries after the GBI says he suffered gunshot wounds. Unclear what led to the gunfire. The GBI says none of the three East Point police officers were injured. But I'm very concerned about police officers. I mean, it's a very dangerous job. The GBI tells us that Harris is in stable condition at the hospital. Reporting live tonight in East Point Time, George Franco, Fox 5 News. George, thanks for the latest there.